Central Illinois, summertime also means construction season. IDOT workers know that all too well, especially this civil engineer. She plays an important part in the process before concrete can be poured at job sites. WCI3's Amanda Brennan explains as we continue to highlight. <laughs> Spending the day outside on the side of the road isn't everyone's first pick of a career path. But for Mary Severson, she jumped at the idea. Engineering was a, a clear path for me. Right now, she's working with construction crews on a project in Springfield. We're repaving 6th Street and we're doing the sidewalks, we're doing driveways. Um, some drainage improvements and curb and gutter. Before the concrete even comes out of this truck here and into the curb, she's the one testing it to make sure it's good to go. We're getting the cylinders ready to test them. So we're tamping down the concrete. We do those in three lifts, making sure we're getting um, the right strength that we want and the right air in the concrete. Checking all those numbers is a pretty important step in the process. She says it all comes down to safety. But when we are putting in this concrete for driveways for people to dr drive their cars on. You want to make sure you're getting the right strength, improving some of the sidewalks to make them ADA compliant, which is important too for, for us. It's not always easy to hit the ground running in the summertime heat, especially since she's expecting a baby any day now. Honestly, sometimes I kind of forget about it until I'm putting on my vest and I realize it's a little tighter today than it was yesterday. Now more than ever, Severson is grateful to have a caring crew right along her side. I know that someone has my back 24 seven. They're always checking on me and making sure I'm aware of where I'm stepping. Oftentimes she's the only woman on a job site, but she doesn't let that bother her. It's a lot of responsibility, I, I would say. Like I've met so many women in this industry that really encouraged me to continue on this career path that I love so much. She hopes that positive influence continues and inspires the next generation of women to follow in her footsteps. I love what I'm doing and I feel the impact in the community and that's what's important to me. Reporting in Springfield, Amanda Brennan, WCIA 3, your local news leader. She's been on the job the last four years at sites across central Illinois. It's a career she's dreamed of ever since watching her grandfather work in the aerospace and mechanical engineering fields. He worked on several space missions, including Apollo, Gemini, and Mercury.